Hello, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and welcome back to Let's Play Imperium 1.8. I'm Seven Foot Dust Bunny, and here we go into darkness, it seems, as we head towards the dig site terminus, um, which is one of the few places we have left to, well, we have signals for left to attack. Um, so, or left to attack, left, well, left to visit as much as anything. Why is the light not on? There we go. The light should be on. Ooh, this is, this is a POI I haven't seen before, actually. This looks interesting. An excavation site might be interesting. Energy sig interesting energy signature. The site appears to be deactivated. Maybe turning it on will help us provide some interesting insights. Search all containers and consoles. Um, for the sake of it, I'm going to leave it on at the moment with the thrusters off, so that should keep the power running relatively low. Suit lights are probably a good idea, and pulse rifle at the ready. Yeah, because I hear something unfriendly already. So, I mean, all this is pretty new in terms of the start of the game now. Definitely seems to be a lever here to open the lower area. I guess we go up and into the building to start with. Looks fairly funky. This, no, that's other faction, okay. So, maybe we flip the switch. The shutter door. Unfortunately, that didn't help. But maybe try to open up the gate manually. Okay. Oh god. Don't don't break my legs. Uh oh oh hello. Whoa, infected. Infected. Okay. Infected bad guy. Infected bad guy to start with. Any more? <laughs> this is looking very legacy all right there's a lever switch here let's try the terminal a second system error all the same stuff we've seen before so I'm not gonna try plowing through that again okay do we flip the switch we flip the switch by the looks of it things are on the tribe warrior seems to have been trapped here I wonder what he was looking for we should look for clues on the consoles and containers. Well, we've tried the console, and that just has the same old, same old on there. Let's go round the back here. And, ooh, it's very green. Okay, so that doesn't seem to be anything, apart from high radiation levels. Oh, another pad. It says, damage data device, should we do it? Yes. After the system was back online, we checked all the ruins on the moons to see if there were there were any other artifacts linked to the obelisk. We didn't find anything, but learned that there seems to be a lot of creatures we hadn't catalogued yet. The drones on the planets were supposed to keep the most dangerous of them at bay, but there's interference with their controls from the energy spikes, increasingly emanating from the obelisks. At least I was lucky, but if Hazan hadn't been there, I'd be history now. The Korhom were there too late, but at least they smoked out some of those nests, some of the nests of these nasty creatures. Okay, so that is 10 of 16. So we still need to find six more. Wow. It's very green again still. Okay. It's blobs. There's some strange blob blobby blobby blobs here. And nope. I was there seeing if there were any loot containers or anything. It doesn't seem to be anything else here, he says. I mean, there's, there's whatever that is, but that again doesn't seem to actually be anything. Hmm. 
I was somehow expecting more of underground bunkerage and things. I mean, maybe we go back up to the upper level and see what's in that, um, in that, like, shelter up there. Because, I mean, these are just deco consoles, they don't seem to do anything. We've been there, so, oh, I guess. Okay, door closing. And let's go in here. Other faction, armoured. Authorised access only. Okay. So. So what do what am I supposed to... Aha! Aha! It says. Well, there's a way in. There's another terminal here. Power container. Yeah, that'll do. I'll eat that one. The other bits can go in the fridge. Yunk, 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 yunk. Um, I did both, didn't I? Yep. Yeah. And a flux coil. Always useful. And a door that is factioned. With no control. I mean, I'm very tempted to shoot some of these doors out. But I'm not sure if I'm supposed to. Stone dust, silicon, and more multi-tool charges. More multi-tool charges. We'll get to you in a minute. Cobalt. I mean, they're providing you with quite a bit of stuff here. So, should be good. Right. Press F to talk to Ren Inal, maintenance ro robot. Okay. Ever since... The thing in the cellar suddenly came to life. Nothing has gone right. Breakdowns and equipment's malfunctions are becoming more frequent. I hear voices in my head saying, Bruendia. Well, we know that mean, what that means. We have, again, urged Tash Aka Talon for information, but she seems unavailable at the moment. We have provisionally sealed the entrance and isolated this console up here from the network so that we can at least still maintain operations. I hardly think that that will do any good in case of doubt. No one dares go down there anymore. Unfortunately, the main power switch is down there. Yep, yeah, well, I've done that. Okay. The power's off. You can turn it back on. Back on from up here. We have to find and use the access outside to get to the lower levels, which I already did. So I feel like there's something more, really, um, that I was supposed to do or find or something. Anything here? No. I just feel like there was, I feel like there should have been more to that. I mean, we've gone down, we've done this, but there was nothing else down here. You've been through here. There's one bad guy, and that was it. Okay. Not sure what else we need to do. Um, let's have a quick check in the quest log. To see what it says. Tales of Tash. Missing logs. Temperate experimental farm check. Location. Okay. Marker. Location. Long found. Yes. Next steps. Find the signal source. Find Tash Talan. Log found. Find the teleporters. Yes. Yes. So, um, okay. I'm not sure what we need to do. Because you can go to all these, but it's not actually telling me anything. The information might help find this person T blah 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 of the Talon, which is cut off. See, that was when I found all the other lot, 
logs. Hmm. I don't seem to have any other markers now. So let's just go and check the... Actually, if I go back down to the console down there. So we had location tracker. So we've been to the scientist camp. We've been to the dig site. We've been to the supply bunker. We've been to the font of knowledge. The experimental farms. Let's mark the location. I think we've been there though. We'll, we'll have a check. I'm guessing that was the plantation. Yeah, that was settlement chief. We've, we've been there, done that. So, I'm gonna say I think we're done on Akur. It seems to me that the next step is maybe to go to one of the other cell well one of the other planets and see what's there what I would love to find as well is on my sort of trial place when I was going around looking at all the new rocks and everything during my 1.8 preview I did find titanium rocks on Akur. Now I can't find titanium rocks. It's probably in a specific biome. Hello. Oh, this is my base. Oh, this is me shooting at my base. So I would love to find some titanium rocks. Hello, anything down in here? This is an interesting little formation. Hmm. I would like to find some titanium rocks because it would be very handy and let me go to a T2 core. I wouldn't mind checking out some of those other Talon areas. Now, okay, we've been here. We know all about this guy. So I'm just going to go check out over here some of these other Talon things and I'll check out some of the other resources and see if I can find anything interesting. I'll bring you back in if I find anything useful. Oh there's a tower over there maybe maybe that is useful before we go out. Oh it's dark here. Silicon deposit. What have we got here? Many many ruins I'm guessing. Because they did mention there were ruins there. This tower is surrounded by a field of ruins, possibly the remnant of an earlier settlement of this planet. Look carefully, maybe you will find something interesting, but keep an eye on the surroundings, it could be dangerous. You mean like the raptor right underneath my ship? That is poised, ready to pounce because, well, because it's night. And we're in night, I think. Hello, Mr. Raptor. Goodbye, Mr. Raptor. Okay. So, what do you got? Um, anything useful? I can hear another Raptor running around. Hello. Hello, Mr. Raptor. I, I heard you. Would you care to get shot in the head? I seem to be hitting the hitbox of the block right here. Hang on. No, I'm still hitting the hitbox of the block right here. Can I, um, how about if I stand here? No. Ah! Okay. Not a good plan. Die. And you seem to just be standing there to get shot. Which is fine by me. You want to stand there and die? That's fine by me. Completely and utterly. Right, anything else? Some vegetables. Hmm. Can't say that was hugely exciting. More vegetables. I did pick up that one, didn't I? Yes. Okay, so we'll 
fridge those bits. I mean, there's a bunch of little ruins around here, which I guess I can just sort of hop around and see what we've got. Unfortunately, I don't have any night vision glasses to help with this. I mean, there, there's a tower, and I mean, we, we, I don't know if most of you who have played before will very much recognize this tower, even though it's in the pitch black. I only have one bullet. Hold fire. I'm just going to get rid of your friend a second. I don't want to shoot my ship. Ow. Shoot me in the butt. There we go. Take that. So, this one, I mean, most people will recognize this as this used to be part of the old Talon quest. When the quest used to start, you used to go up to the top here. And there are a bunch of panels at the top, so I'm going to see if there's still anything there. Oh, that didn't work quite as well as I planned. We go, we'll get the sprouts, we'll get those goodies. We might as well take anything we can lay our hands on here. Yes, raptors, I hear you. Damn those night raptors. This is the only place in Akura I've actually seen raptors so far. So Akura seems to be very sort of passive as a first area. But I am interested to see whether the um, whether the panels that were at the top are still there. They are. And when you used to get close to it, it used to activate. But no more. No more does it activate and glow. Okay, so that means I've got to go down a quick way. There we go, and take a little breather halfway down. Let the jetpack recharge. There we go. So, old tower is still a thing, but there doesn't seem to be much here of value. turn the thrusters back on. I mean there's ruins around here again but again doesn't seem to be that much of value. Oh, I like the fact the raptors are uh, the raptors there attacking the um, the native the wildlife. Oh, there are raptors a lot of raptors here. There's a lot of raptors right here. But again, nothing of particular value that I can see. Hey, back up, back up. Excuse you. Ah! Ow! That hurt. You damaged my armor, you bastard. I don't want to shoot my ship. Ah! Ah! What are you doing? What are you doing? Die! I don't like you. You're doing weird things, okay. That wound was pretty harsh. Okay. But there doesn't seem to be anything of particular interest here. Another barrel or something there. But nothing really of value. Another raptor. So, okay, I'm going to go back to doing a bit of planetary exploration and seeing whether there's anything worth seeing around. Because there's clearly some other Talon things. Um, but if not, I'll bring you back in and we might head over to another planet, I guess. A quick interlude, because on the bright side, I found some titanium rock. 
Wow. It's one of these ones with a stupid amount of hit points. I wonder how much um, rock is actually in there. Um, let's just sort out inventory a second first. Okay. And, yeah, let's go. But yeah, titanium bearing rock here does seem to exist on the planet. Though, this number of hit points is horrific. Um, so I hope it's worth it, because I don't want to have to, like, take down, you know, 30 or 40 of these to get the titanium I need to get a T2 core. Because I, I think I've got enough cobalt now. To actually build my warp drive but I can't put the warp drive in without a, without a core extender I'm already over budget all right let's see and come on come on and wow it's so slow one titanium one titanium from that rock we got one titanium from a rock with 10,000 hit points or a thousand hit points ah Elyon 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 I'm loving the new improvements but seriously you cannot be serious that that's how that's gonna be that seems to have an absolute ludicrous number of hit points. I'm going to go and pick up some of these bits just in case they come in handy later. There's another titanium rock right there. Right, I will save you from watching me do this because if I've got to shoot down like five or more of those, it's just it's just going to be painful. Well, I've been flying around trying to explore the planet and I've been looking at these Talon farms and found a few things and titanium rocks and alike and I've managed to get 15 titanium which I think should be enough to get me a T2 core. I don't remember exactly how much I need but then I flew over this which appears to be the activator so I'm gonna have a closer look because it's making one the weird noise that we know about so I'm gonna go and see if there's oh, I'm stuck I'm stuck in my own ship why am I stuck why am I stuck there we go I'm intrigued to see if it does anything okay Okay, I was wondering if there was more to it than that. Is there any sort of investigation nearby this? It doesn't appear to be any sort of camp or anything nearby. It's dark as sin, mind. Which isn't helping. So I apologise for that. In fact, it's fairly short, so I'm just... I don't know, just going to try and look round here on the ground see if there's any investigation site nearby doesn't appear to be anything but there is indeed this activator so not sure what that's all about but I'm gonna check over here check this out I'm basically gonna try and uncover everything on this planet just to check I'm not missing anything before I head out there's another there's another activator here in the mountains this one is diamond shaped so I'm just gonna get out and have a look at this a second because I'm guessing there's probably something to this in the new story okay what do I need to do to make it work hello Hmm. 
I will head on. So as I'm flying around, I'm in Talon territory and I found a carbon deposit. Now I I do want to have a go at mining a carbon deposit because I'm kind of interested to see what it's like. But um, I believe if I mine this carbon deposit, if I check out um, things, so mine ore in Talon territory. Minus five. I don't want to destroy my rep with the Talon just yet. Plus, once I get to friendly, I don't have to worry about it. I can mine there in their territory to my heart's content. Oh, so this, I must be crossing the planet line. So that's every deposit on the planet discovered. I've only got these little markers to look at over here which are still question marks and then we've looked at well everything so what is this tech ruins okay let's check these out an interesting technical structure rather on a rather rural world be careful when approaching and looting it again there appears to be um cyborgs here oh no these are unfriendly cyborgs how oh good god oh good god okay that hurt like hell i was assuming they'd be friendly <laughs> unlike like the other ones but oh god no 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 oh jesus help 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 let me get back inside I might be backing off a little there. That really hurt. Um, ow. I wasn't ready for that. I wasn't expecting to get shot. Okay. Uh, yes, hello. Goodbye. Goodbye to you too. Right. Let's try that again. Let's start with a bandage. There may be another bandage in just a minute. Because if I get killed, I'm a long way from where I want to respawn. Come on, give me the... There we go. Where, where's, where's the... Where's the dead drone? I wanted to loot his stuff. I expect him to be here somewhere. I'm trying to follow his footprints in the grass. But I don't see where he is. He seems to have disappeared. Oh well, let's go get the other one. Okay, I'm assuming there's more in here somewhere because I'm here. I, I heard drone noises. It did tell me to be careful. To be fair, it did warn me this that that this could hurt. I just assumed they were friendly. And do you know what? Assume did don't you? Can I have your gun? So, I don't know where the drone body here is. He was somewhere up near this tree. But I can't see his... I can't see his body. Oh, there's, there, there's one right there. Oh. I think the damaged cyborg actually doesn't attack you. It's like the damaged assault one. I, I hear more. I hear more, but I don't see it. I don't know where he is, but I hear him. <laughs> Very much worrying me. I can hear one, but not see it. 
I just keep thinking I'm gonna get pounced on. Ah, right there. So, yeah, you don't appear to be unfriendly. You're definitely not unfriendly now. But not a lot of looting here. So, I'm not sure that was actually worth it. Anything need repair here after I shot my ship while I was crapping myself? No. Okay. Okay, so that's the tech ruins. Just watch out for the one grumpy assault cyborg around. And uh, we'll check out the last couple of uh, things here. I didn't get any rep movement from any of them. Small wreckage. Now these are just standard wreckages that used to be on all the worlds and there'd occasionally be some bits to find here on them like in here you could get into this and get into that one bit of meds and in the case of this one and yeah, let's go salvage there you go and some food some water not a lot else not me or did that look funny and so that leaves just one to search out which is just over here which appears to be another activator now I found them all I've been to them all I've made them all do their glowy thing but it doesn't actually seem to do anything hmm okay currently none the wiser so I think the plan is to head to another planet okay so I'm back at base now and I've been around and collected up some extra resources. I have some more fuel on the go. And I'm planning on finishing these off. Now, I want to make some important things. Hopefully, I'll be able to make them and use them before I travel to the next planet. I was looking around at the choices of planet. We'll just have a look here. Now, if I have a look. Akur has carbon, iron, copper, silicon. Nigus has um, iron, copper, silicon, and cobalt. But I think I'm alright for cobalt at the moment. Um, Skillion has promethium and neodymium. And Mascopon has additional titanium and pentaxid so really skillion and mascapon i need to go to because one to do more mining i want to have some promethium just so i can use the better mining drill um and i'm also going to want the neodymium but i think i'm gonna have to go and get the neodymium or, or the um, Promethium first because the mining neodymium with the hand mining tool is just going to drive me gradually insane so we need to unlock some tech I think we don't actually need the warp drive to get there but I would like to have the warp drive so I would like to have the warp drive I don't also need the shield and the shield is CPU wise is going to be far far out of my range I believe uses a lot of CPU 16,000 whereas I believe CPU wise I'm trying to spot it now 3,000 so I think I can use the warp drive 
because I believe T2 is going to give me uh, 10,000. So that will give me a few to spare. Probably enough to maybe upgrade one of my generators to the higher level generator and maybe upgrade some of my engines which isn't strictly speaking necessary but I can do it if I want to um, but it depends what the resources are like the, to be honest the main thing I want is gonna be the warp drive so let me start off by seeing if we can build a warp drive we can so I want a pentaxid tank and a warp drive ideally I'd like to upgrade some of these other bits as well I have some space for some additional fuel tanks probably take two of those and I wouldn't mind some thrusters but we'll have to see about that ah the other thing I think I ought to wait on before I go that far is I need that T2 core I need a flux coil I need two flux coils oh you bastards I need two flux coils I th mm. damn it um, I was thinking this takes flux coil but it doesn't I have one flux coil I found but I don't have another one and flux coils require neodymium so they've really taken down what you can do on this planet we are gonna have to leave these bits then get them ready but leave them damn it annoying um, so in which case I guess I can unlock the drill I would have liked the engines for the lift just because neodymium is dead heavy I don't want to get caught out stuck on the planet with a shed load of neodymium I'd also very much like the portable constructor that would be very helpful Hmm. Hmm. Choices, choices. So, the mobile constructor would be really useful because I can make a lot of useful things with it. Um, I do have a slot for it in the vessel. But I don't have the core. So, right. Drill. Do you require anything like a flux core? You do not. Excellent. Can I make one of you, please? Yes, I can make you. And oh, I have. It takes 10 Promethean pellets. I can only make 10 Promethean pellets. But I think that's worth it. I think that's a fair trade-off. Uh, one other thing I wanted to do, if, especially if I'm going to another planet, is load that up with 200 of this and we'll chuck that in there and we'll just tell that to make some plastic at, or some carbon substrate while I'm away. Same for you and that will keep me my the rest of my gear ready to go I did want to see if I could um, well, I'm gonna be able to get the base airtight before I go by building five of these little grow plots but I don't think I'm gonna be ready to pressurize it because I haven't got the O2 cylinder but it wouldn't hurt to see if I can make a grow light. Can I make a grow light yet? Uh, grow light? Anything like a grow light? 
Do I need to unlock grow lights? I don't remember. I don't remember if we have to unlock grow lights. Are they under misc or something like that? Forest fields are under misc. Fusion cells, tools, no. Wouldn't be under weapons. So, where is the grow light? Where's grow lights? There's a grow light. That's capital vessel grow light. What about base? Oh, I've already got it on base, so why couldn't I find it? Base. Oh, it's grow lamp there. One, two. Perfect. And I've got a drill with some charges ready to go. I haven't got a shed ton of charges. Which is why I would have liked the constructor, because then I could have made some more charges on the fly while I'm there. But, needs must as the devil drives, as they say. So let's splot these down. Yoink, yoink, jobs are good. And grow lights. Here we go. But for now, I'm going to turn the lights off. And we're going to leave the base recharging. Because it should be charging. Which it is. My other thought before I go is actually to extend these solar panels out another set. Which I'm probably going to do. So. Between episodes, I am going to extend out this solar panel bank and get myself all prepared to travel to Skillon. And that's where we're going. But I will say thank you very much for watching. Like and subscribe as always, and join us again next time. Thanks a lot.